run in really fast and, you know, stake the other team. Yeah. We'll see. You'll see here, yeah. Game one on Town and City. That's is a really good snake stage. He has a lot of space to uh, throw his projectiles and he can land really well with the platform mm -hmm. if he goes high. Yep. Setting up the zone with the grenades. Mm -hmm. Le they haven't really been challenging Leaf all too much. They kind of just been going for Shasta. Yeah, maybe, I don't know. I feel like they should always try to double team Snake because he's like combo food pretty much. Yeah. Maybe they, uh, I mean, uh, I think earlier on they were they were like taking off stocks off of Shasta and then he had to share stocks. So if they not confident and they can get the kill, then I can see that happening too. Yeah. Fonzie doing a good job of just kind of staying away from the from the chaos though. Yeah. He's only got 37% on him and the red team already kind of being stacked on the damage here. Yeah. Really good stuff for the Yoshi. Ooh, the pivot F smash. I thought he could get, touch the dash grab right outside of range. That's another one of those moves that like puts your hurtbox backwards slightly so you can mm -hmm. whip punish like grabs or like attacks and then you can hit them. S similar with uh, Mario's F smash. Right. That was good stuff for the blue team getting the first stock off of Shasta. Oh, not the Tony of the Fortress Mike, but still sitting him really far on stage. And he's not even able to come back. The Shasta dropping another free stock. Yeah, I mean, that's what has been happening is that Leaf has been uh, stocking the tanks. Or, or talking the tanks. Taking the stocks very well. Yeah. But then, uh, usually Shasta has been losing stocks either from, like, early kills or uh, edge guard situations. Yeah. Spanky here chilling there with the Charizard. Still in the second stock, low percent. It seems like he likes to use Charizard more in a neutral like, compared to Sweet Tea. Yeah, definitely used it a lot more. I feel because usually Sweet Tea had it pulled out for the survivability for the most part. Yeah, I actually think Charizard is not too bad to just try to play in teams because he lives so long and he's so strong. I don't think Charizard is that bad in general. I just think he gets kind of overshadowed by the other two Pokemon that are on the team. You know? <laughs> oh, he's got the C4 stick on him though. Is it still on him? I can't tell. Oh no, it fell off. Thank for the blue team oh mm -hmm. the upbeat going through the ledge man that hitbox is really crazy yeah I think that hitbox targets like the opponents first before it targets the ledge though because sometimes it can mess up your edge guards no spike coming in from Spanky but still a lot of damage being tacked on to Shasta again potentially looking at a last share stock very soon yeah Leaf FC trying to get the stock out of here but there's Fonzie taking out Shasta's stock and he's forced to get the share stock now Spanky's on his last okay Fonzie hanging on to his stock lead though. Yeah. Keeping think, the blue team alive. I think Yoshi is just so floaty and really hard to like approach sometimes is that is making it so that he can uh, survive very long. Like he's yeah. basically avoided combat for a lot of this match. Yeah, and he's he's relatively heavy too, not like super light, so he can actually live really long time over hits mm -hmm. as well. Yeah. Okay, snake off stage. Yeah, just using safe aerials and then just pushes their opponent off stage so that he can survive for a long time. Oh wow, and Leaf's stock's already gone. Okay. Okay, just gotta watch the Ivysaur at the ledge, one of the scariest characters to deal with here. Shasta trying to try and find a way to land, gets hit by the dash attack. Ooh, not even needing the spike, just the raw forward air. Sitting him off stage super far back. Yeah, Spanky and, uh, and uh, Fonzie looking real good that time around. Yeah, really good stuff. Fonzie especially. Yeah. I think he got like four kills alone. Look at Yoshi. So happy that he did like... That he won. That he's actually good in Smash. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess Amsa makes a case for Yoshi in Melee. Yeah, definitely. But it's like one of those things like only one person is really yeah. using that character. So, oh boy. Shout out to Amza. He's the one to the summit, by the way, too. So yeah, shout out to Amza. Just uh, you know, I believe he quit his job, right, to play to play melee. Yeah, so. he's actually a professional melee player now. He's yeah. a re he's a Red Bull athlete, like uh, like Snake Eyes. I, I believe Daigo? Question mark. Daigo is a Red Bull athlete, I believe. Yeah. Yeah. And so uh, uh, and Leffen. Leffen. Well, not Leffen. He isn't anymore. Oh, okay. But Pup okay. is. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. everything's moving around so yeah. fast. Anyways, here we go. Oh, okay, we're switching to the Falcon and the oh. Toon Link. Okay. okay. <laughs> this is interesting. It's the first time seeing a post-patch Falcon on the stream so far. Let's see yeah. what Leaf FC can do. He was using a lot of pre-patch Falcon as well. So. Yeah. And he got good results with him so far. At yeah. least at the local level, so. Let's see what happens here. 
And uh, Shasta using his uh, Smash 4 character in Toon Link. Mm -hmm. Don't see much of Toon Link in uh, Ultimate in comparison to like the other Links. But right. I, st I still think his game plan works really well in teams. Mm -hmm. Which is just be as frustrating as possible with all the projectiles. Yeah. Make it very hard to get, get killed. But, but he's off stage right yeah, now. Yeah, going really aggressive off stage. Mm -hmm. Oh, the clean down air. That's actually going to be really easy to hit. Falcons up these because they send his hurtbox quite a bit when he tries to recover. Mm -hmm. And that down air hitbox on Ivysaur is already incredibly large in the first place. Mm -hmm. I don't know how I feel about Falcon and doubles. I feel like, in general, he likes to have a lot of space and like to be able to do tech chase situations and like just be able to really combo. But like he needs that running running space, but yeah. it's looking like it's not quite happening, and wow, the dare into the Pokemon Switch, so he actually gets out of that uh, knee setup right there. Yeah, I think another character would be able to get hit by that down air knee, but you can actually switch out of uh, hit stun pretty fast with Pokemon Trainer. On the chase against Shasta when he got sent up there. Shasta yep. doing a good job on the survivability this time around. Now they switched to Toon Link. Yeah, Toon Link does a kit. Wow, from the heavens with the downer came all the way from the top. But the up throw is going to be enough with the Charizard. Not even needing the pop from assist. Yeah. Leaf already looking like he's down. Oh, he's going to be down to his last stock very soon. Because Falcon can get comboed pretty easily. I guess the yeah, bomb for him. Yeah, he's, they're kind of changing up the strategy. He's staying back this time around. Leaf SC trying to get something to happen here. Oh, but lands on top of Ivy, so gets sniped by the up air. Yep. Oh, every time he wants a knee setup, he yeah, just does he the just Pokemon switch. Right out of it. It's yeah. unfortunate. Okay, Fonzie's trying to apply some pressure at the ledge. Okay, Back throw off. Oh, yeah, he threw him off stage to try to help his partner, but Chas already died before he could do anything. Mm -hmm. Alright, up out of shield. Yeah, nice. that'll do it. Yeah, good punish on the switch this time. Oh, nice backer to hit him out of the jump. Wow, Ooh. he went really deep to try to Edgeguard Falcon and just lost his life for it. Yeah, now all of a sudden we got an even game. That was a really clutch stock coming from Leaf. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Uh -huh. See what we can do? Oh, the armor from the double jump actually saving him from being down there, spiked off stage. That was yeah. really good timing from Leaf FC, mm -hmm. but not able to get the stock. Yeah, that would have been tragic. Me? Nope. Not quite going to be able to get that. No, he does have the safe control. Oh, gets hit by the up there, though. Shasta, let's see what he can do. Leaf already at a high percent again, but, I mean, this Falcon, he can kill either of these two pretty much any time. Oh, but lands on top of Ivysaur again. This time getting caught by the up smash, and now we got a 2v1 with Shasta. Yeah. I mean, if Shasta can take out one of these stocks, then he can easily bring this back. I mean, Team Link is a character that can, you know, like we said before, frustrate opponents. I feel like, more optimally, he would take out Spanky first. Uh, just because I feel like the Razor Leaf can kind of intercept the, the projectile game that Shasta wants to employ. But right now, it looks like that's not quite happening. They're just suffocating him, making yeah, sure just, he can't get anything Yeah, they're just keeping him in the middle of both of them, just juggling him back and forth. Yeah. Kind of playing like an extended game of volleyball. Yeah, and there's the up air. Yeah, That'll that's do it. it. 2 0 Spanky and Fonzie sending them out of the tournament. Really good stuff. But Yoshi was.